Okay, today we're going to try rotisserieing a chicken. This chicken is 5.71 pounds, 5.7, almost five and three quarter pounds. And we're going to see how this turns out. Okay, we got the bird trussed and uh, we got it seasoned with a little bit of onion powder, garlic powder, Italian seasoning, like a McCormick's Italian and um, what else, some pepper and salt. We're going to throw that in at, uh, I think, 350 for about an hour on rotisserie. So we're going to get that in there and see how this turns out. Okay, the bird's in, and it's on. We're warming it up here. Uh, we're going to let this go. I have it at 350 for an hour. We'll come back and check it in about a half hour, see how it looks, and uh, we'll see then. All right, here we are after about a half hour. It's still juicing pretty good. Um, just turning around, it's a half hour here. It may have to go longer than an hour, but we'll check back in a, another half and see what it looks like. Okay, there was about a minute left. I paused it. I'm just going to come in here. I don't think it's near ready yet. We're going to poke it by the thigh here and see what kind of temp we have in there. I'm like I said, turn it on. And let's see what we got. Oh man, it's already at 143. Stick it in a little further. 139, yeah, there it goes down. We're gonna let this go for another 10 minutes. It was an hour. Okay, it's been an hour 10. We're gonna stick the thigh again and see where we're at here for temp. We're still at 135, even with it sitting. We're gonna go another 10 minutes. Okay, we got an hour and 20 minutes, and we're seeing a lot of white juices coming out of here now, especially probably where I poked it. We might take this out and just let it sit. I think we're gonna be done here. Let's stick this thing here and see where we're at. Oh yeah, we're done. All right, that was an hour and 20. We'll see how this, uh, Turns out. Okay, here we go. A 5.7 pound chicken. Went for about an hour and 20 minutes. Actually, it was like 19 minutes, but that's fine. And uh, we're gonna let it rest, cut it open, see what it's like. Okay, here we go. It's been sitting for about 20 minutes or so. Let's cut into it here and see what uh, what we look like here. little pink in the center little pink down there it looks like but not much nah you know what this is good so we're going to uh we're going to use you know a lot of this for leftovers and cook it and other stuff too but actually yeah i guess it by the bone it is a little juicing yep probably an hour and a half to an hour and 40 minutes would have been good it's still cooking though so that's uh, looking all right. Let's see what the breast looks like here. Oh, is that juicy? Oh my God. I don't know if you can see that juice. We'll put it on a plate and I will show you that. And uh, uh, Yes, the breast is very juicy. So a uh, little bit longer probably. This is a big, big ass chicken too. This was a five, five point seven pounder, but uh, We'll put it on the plate, plate it, and show you. Okay, here we are. I threw this drumstick on this plate just to show you. This thing is gigantua. It is gigantua. And the the dark meat was done. It, it was sitting. It's fine. And, and the uh, white meat here, it's nice and juicy still. I was eating it while I was cutting it. So the rotisserie did work well. Um, it is very, very good. Uh, even a dark meat, it's done. It's delicious. Um, and it, like I said, this was a huge, uh, huge bird. That's a huge drumstick. But anyway, so I give uh, the Emerald Legacy XL360 Air Fryer thumbs up on a 5.7 pound chicken. Very good. All right. Thanks for watching.